And on the back line, Broderick and Cook. And we are underway at the Eddie Bush Memorial Arena in Collingwood. I'm Dale West. Thanks for joining us, folks. Let's have some fun here. Right from the start, a quick shot. Fullerton traps it on the little Collingwood giveaway. Blues almost got caught with too many on the ice, but uh, it's a nice way to kill a penalty if you can get away with it. Here's Stock picking his way all the way up through the zone and rolls it through the crease. Shots on goal guy being mean tonight. That one was rolling in. If Talk doesn't cover it, it should count, but they didn't even get that one, so it's five nothing in shots. Into the Collingwood zone, shot deflected, and Fullerton able to kick it away. Still loose in front, Fitzgerald started all over again. Game tied at zero, Reddick takes a hit, play, and again, Talk steers it to the side, but not out, and now a chance breaking down the ice is Sims. Sims cutting in front, a short hit, it gets the shot away, off the net. Uh, there's going to be a penalty to Collingwood. We've got four on four for Big Hurdles, Johnston and Sage in front of Sage, Sage shot, then stopped by Tuck. 30 seconds left in the four on four. Cush with the extra man, but the power play coming to an end. Flip right on that, Tuck mishandles it, Reddick gets a chance, and somehow Tuck got a save, and then another one. McIntosh and Reddick getting good shots there. Here's Lamanis, gets it back to Reddick. To Lamanis, who couldn't do much with it and tried to steer back in the middle. That didn't work. Now another race for it. Here goes Sims on a breakaway shorthanded. Sims gets the shot away. Fullerton with the save. But both goaltenders coming up with some good saves. Didn't have to be spectacular, but both of them have to make some uh, solid stops. So we'll start the period. Teams at full strength. Scoreboard is even at zero. Along the side, just five seconds left in the power play. Lamanis. Finish out the penalty hill. Loose puck comes in front. Riddle's shot is steered away by Fullerton. That took a strange bounce. There's a shot by Stock. Nice save by Fullerton through the crowd. And Stock hits Laville with it. Now Laville trying to force his way in. Sage gets it towards the net. Here goes Sage. Backhand pass. Shot. Oh, what a save by Tock. Henstock got his stick on him, but Tock got the pad across. There's a deflection by Sage. And a second save. Kept in at the line by Horsley. And over the line, Forster with a chance now scored. From high in the slot, just under the crossbar. Quick shot by Forster at the 15 minute mark. Innocent little play at the blue line. Buck didn't go out. Forster just stepped into the play and snapped a hired shot away. High in the slot and that's under the crossbar for a one nothing lead. So, or the uh, power play opportunities. 0 for three for uh, Milton. And uh, Collingwood, uh, uh, sorry, 0 for four for Milton and 0 for six for Collingwood heading into this final period. Garvey coming back for it this time for Collingwood. They give it away. Here goes Bonnick in alone. Oh, wow. Nice stick saved by Fullerton. Play broken up goes to Johnston. Johnston gets by one at the side of the net. Between his legs, got a nice shot away. Wow. Pass in behind the net. Comes to Reddick. Shot off the post, off the goalie's shoulder and into his glove. Now Garvey. Tied up by Johnston. Johnston falls down, but the Blues come up with it. Here comes Reddick to the front to Len Manis. Wrist shot. Kicked away. Rebound in front. Rolls to the post and stops. Dooley behind the net. Tried to wrap around. Right on the post, though, was Tuck for that one. Four seconds left in the power play. Blues come up with it in the slot. Burnett shot. Nice save by Tuck. Kicks it away. We'll keep it in. Shot through the crowd. Doesn't get to the net. Now loose puck. Sims at center ice. Has Reddick to beat, backhand, scores. Sims made sure he got across center ice and then just steered it towards the net. And the Menace go up 2-0 with just 44 seconds remaining. So it looks like Milton's going to extend its winning streak uh, with that second goal there. But uh, some nights losses aren't all bad news. And the Milton Menace uh, come up with a late goal in the second period, an empty net goal in the third period. 
and a really solid game in the goal from uh, Carter Talk. Next weekend, it's Pickering here on Friday night at 7, Pickering here Saturday night at 5.30. We're back here for both of those games, and we'll see you every Friday and Saturday this month here on Hockey TV from the Eddie Bush Memorial Arena in Collingwood. There you see the final score of the Milton Menace edging the Collingwood Blues by a 2 to nothing count uh, for Joe and Mitch and everybody else here at the Eddie Bush Memorial Arena in Collingwood. I'm Dale West. Thanks for dropping in, folks.